Hey guys, so got a little surprise first impressions here. This one's the Zero Gravity from JS and it's a new and improved version of the previous model, the Zero. So the JS Zero was a super fun kind of all round board, but I felt it was limited as the waves got overhead. So four, four foot and above, the board kind of felt like it was gonna slide out, especially at like four and a half foot, in four and a half foot surf. Anyway, the Zero Gravity is an improvement on, on that. So what they've done is they've taken kind of inspiration and combined the best features of the original Monster Box and the Air 17X. So this is in the X series. So my first impressions is it's a super fun board. I haven't ridden it in overhead waves yet. So I've ridden it in kind of a few different conditions. So the first day was kind of like an onshore point break. Couldn't really determine how the board was feeling, but I could tell it had good like power uh, and hook in the pocket. Uh, the second surf was like two foot kind of scrappy beaches, I'd say, but had a few like barreling peaks, so it could really test how it'd go, like drawing off the bottom and it felt really good. Like you could fit a few really good turns and I liked the bite it had in the hold in like, like kind of small pockets and more critical sections. It felt really good, especially on rounder turns, a good combo between rounder turns and whippier surfing. Third surf was today and it was like a junky kind of semi onshore kind of would it be two two to three foot kind of swell and yeah that's when i felt the board kind of come into life especially on my backhand this board was really good fins i've been enjoying uh the fcs2 hello and dino fins so what was really good about them was just that hold it still felt fast and loose but had that hold on the turns and in the whippy up kind of pockets oh that didn't make sense but kind of the more like whippy sections where you could really come off the bottom and square up, it felt good. Anyway, super fun all round board so far. Uh, wide points, I'd say dead center, and they've stuck with the reverse concave, so that means it's pretty much deep under the front foot and then shallow at both ends. So you can kind of see that if you zoom in, it's got a, the, deep, the deeper concave is quite apparent. And also the rails, so the rails are like medium to full. We'll talk about this more when the full review comes, but yeah, I'm definitely enjoying this board and uh, I like how the tail is not as f full or thick as the original Zero. So yeah, that's the Zero Gravity. So far, it's definitely an improvement on the Zero. And yeah, the full review will come as soon as we can get it done. I want to thank Board Garage, my boss Jake, for giving me a spin on this as a demo because boards are quite expensive. So what a bloody legend. Anyway, thanks for watching. Like for the kids.